Quite some time ago, I remember reading a post where someone asked on a forum, why do Mac Pro people use the version numbers like 4,1 and 5,1 and not the years like other Macs, instead of saying like a Mac Pro 2010 or 2009? Then I saw this post recently where the writer asked, is the comma 1 necessary? Is there a 4, 2 or a 5, 3? The first part is pretty easy. Apple signs every computer a model identifier, which uses a product name, then a number. The first computer to have one of these model identifiers was the original iMac. Usually when someone says they have a MacBook Air, they would say, I have a MacBook Air 2015 11-inch, and that's good enough. If you were to go by the model identifier, this is the MacBook Air 7, 1, then the 13-inch version of the 2015 MacBook Air is the MacBook Air 7, 2. Historically, the number after the comma has been applied to computers with different size options, which includes the iMacs and the entire MacBook family. And while editing this, I did notice one error that I made. I forgot to mention the Mac Minis, which do have different version numbers based on their configurations, making them kind of unique to the Mac lineup up until now. Regardless of the specs found in a Mac Pro, these have always used just a comma one as there's no size difference. However, with the Apple Silicon, this looks like it's changing. The latest MacBooks as of recording this video are the M1 Pro and M1 Max, and these have four different IDs. They are the MacBook Pro 18,1 for the M1 Pro 16 inch, the MacBook Pro 18,2 for the M1 Max 16 inch, the MacBook 18,3 for the M1 Pro 14 inch, and the 18,4 for the 14 inch M1 Max. Apple seems to have changed the IDs where the larger MacBooks get the lower number and the smaller MacBooks have the larger number. That answers the first half of this question. We use the comma system as that's the official ID Apple assigns to its computers. It seems very likely that the Apple Silicon Mac Pros and the Mac Minis are going to have more than one ID. The second part to this question is why don't we use the year instead of the version number? Mac Pro owners refer to their Macs by the product identifiers because of their ability to flash the firmware in certain models to upgrade them to a newer Mac. A Mac Pro 2009 4,1 that's flashed to the 5,1's firmware is still a Mac Pro 2009. Even when you view about this Mac, it refers to the initial manufacturing date of that revision. Even if speaking from a performance mindset, it is exactly the same as the 2010, which is a 5,1. In the system report, the product identifier has changed to the 5,1, even though it's a 2009 Mac Pro. Also, Apple has used the years interchangeably to refer to the same product identifier. The Mac Pro 5,1 has both 2010 and 2012 versions. Internally, these are 100% the same, other than the base configurations they originally shipped with. So that's why the Mac Pro community, especially the classic Mac Pro owners, refer to the computers by the model instead of the year. 